Hello and welcome back to the Wellness Check. Before we begin this guided meditation, I just want to send out a little precaution that this is a protocol, a meditation that I use with my clients, and it is for the purpose of beginning a repair process for childhood wounds. And particularly, childhood wounds having to deal with your caregivers, your parents, your caregivers, whoever helped to bring you up when you were a child. And this can be a very complex, complicated, heavy thing to work on. So if you have endured a lot of trauma in your childhood, if you have childhood wounds, unmet needs, um, you can try this protocol But if at any point this just becomes a little too much for you, then I just encourage you to hit pause, um, reorient yourself to the room, maybe don't even finish it if it's activating. This is something that I like to do with my clients, but I do it with them. I can guide them through the process. I can keep them in their window of tolerance. Um, And it can be a very helpful healing thing but I can't keep my eyes over all of you viewers who might be watching this. So just know what your thresholds are. And if this might be something that's too activating for you, skip it, maybe share it with a friend, something like that. If you'd like to give it a try, go, go for it. Just know what your thresholds are. And my hope through this is that it will really be able to help at least start the repair process, give you a creative outlet for repairing childhood wounds. Here we go. Settle into yourself. Get comfortable. And take two deep breaths. Imagine yourself as a young child. And in the scene, imagine that you grew up in a family different from your family of origin. Choose a set of parents ideally suited to you and your nature and bring to mind the scene of them being with you in a way that would feel absolutely secure in the attachment of the relationship. Just absolutely secure in the attachment of that relationship. Since imagination creates new possibilities, you can shape and reshape this scene in any way that you want till it feels just right. In this scene, notice the ways in particular that these ideal parents are being with you that lead you to feel completely secure in the relationship. Let the scene fade and bring to mind a second scene with these ideal parents. Them being with you in a way that makes you feel completely safe and protected. These parents know how to provide you with a safe haven. They are fiercely protective, but not overprotective. So imagine specifically the ways of them being with you that would give you the sense of being completely safe and protected as a child. And when you imagine the details of this scene, notice the ways they're being with you that lead you to feel so safe and protected. And notice the effect that this has on your state of mind. the scene fade and imagine another scene of yourself with these ideal parents. Imagine them being so carefully attuned to you. These parents are completely present. 
You know as you imagine it that they are really interested in everything that you do. They're interested in every change in your behavior. You can sense the ways that they track all of the developmental changes that you go through as a young child. They're so carefully attuned to you and interested in all of these changes. But as you imagine this scene, what's most important is that you imagine it in such a way that they are not attuned to simply your behavior, but to your internal state. These parents are constantly wondering out loud about what you feel, what motivates your behavior. They're interested in what you think about and how you put together your world so that you feel deeply seen and known by them. Imagine parents who are that carefully attuned to your internal state, not just your behavior. And notice the effect this has on your state of mind. Let the scene fade. And now imagine a time as a young child when you were emotionally upset about something. Only this time you imagine you grew up in a family different from your family of origin with these ideal parents. They see right away how upset you are. And imagine that they respond to you in just the way that you most need. Notice how they approach you, the physical closeness they offer to you in comfort and in verbal reassurance. Imagine them comforting you in all the right ways and notice the effect that that has on your state of mind. Let the scene fade and imagine another scene with these ideal parents as a young child. Imagine them being with you in a way that they are absolutely open and expressive about their delight in everything that you do. These ideal parents are not subtle. They're consistent and open about their joy in everything that you discover and explore. But more importantly, these ideal parents are openly expressive about the joy in your being. You know that you are a deep source of joy and that everything that you do in life gives them great pleasure. You can feel it when you are around them. And notice the effect that this has on your state of mind Having parents that are that openly and expressive and are delighted in every single thing that you do. More importantly, they delight in your very being. You are the deepest source of joy and satisfaction to them. In so many ways, you can feel it. Notice the effect that this has on your state of mind and on your esteem. Let the scene fade and imagine another scene with your ideal parents in a time that you are exploring and discovering something new and you have their absolute support. These parents are openly supportive to you, encouraging you to explore and discover in different ways. They want you to bring out your best and strongest sense of self. They are not threatened by that. They have no agendas for you. They just want you to discover all that you can be 
and to be your strongest and best sense of self. So imagine the scene in which you are exploring something new with their complete and absolute support, bringing out the best and strongest sense of self that you can be. Notice the effect that that has on your state of mind. Imagine what it might have been like, what your sense of self might have been like, had you grown up getting that kind of support with every step of development. Your best, strong, and most unique sense of self. Lastly, there is something that you needed as a child when you were growing up that you never quite got. Bring that feeling to mind now, that very familiar feeling to you. There's something that you needed over and over again and you never quite got it and there is a very familiar feeling you had about that. Bring that feeling to mind. You can let yourself feel it right now. And imagine the ideal parents stepping into the scene and they see right away what you're feeling. And they respond to you in just the way that you most need. Just the right way. Begin that process of healing. Let the scene fade and notice the effect that that had on your state of mind. You can begin to orient yourself again. I will count down from five to one and you will fully awaken. Five, four, three, two, one. Fully awake. Take several deep breaths. Take note of how you feel, any changes in your body and in your mind, just notice. And come back to this ideal parent protocol whenever you'd like. Thank you for checking in with your wellness. I'll see you soon.